On October 13, 1775, the second of our now six full-time military branches was founded, the Navy. Just a few months after the Continental Congress establishment of the Army, a naval movement began. On October 13, a letter from General George Washington was read in Congress. The letter outlined that he had taken three schooners under his command in order to intercept enemy supply ships. Despite earlier resistance, this action by the Commander-in-Chief swept aside the reluctance to arm seagoing vessels and the Continental Navy was established. The importance of the naval force was easily recognized in the months and years to follow. Today, the Navy is seen around the globe as a form of strength for the U.S., as that fleet of three has grown to a fleet of nearly 500 ships in active or reserve status, and over 300,000 active duty personnel.